YouTube. Shea Bear 1000 here. Now, I'm sitting outside because we're going to do a review slash flea market find on this item right here. Stay tuned, I'll show you what it is. Okay guys, I got this right here, can you see what that says? Camera binoculars, uh, usually don't buy binoculars for any reason, but this was pretty neat. Well, as you can see, I gave five bucks for them. She said they'd never been used, but... I did look through it. It seems to be all here. Let's open these up. They seem to be pretty cool. A little lens cleaning pad there. Um, but I did notice this thing here for you know your straps is missing on this side. Uh, the two batteries that came with it which I doubt if they're any good so I happen to have I happen to had had a fresh rechargeable pair of Rayovacs here I've been charging them up so we can try this thing out I did read up on it a little bit it's pretty self-explanatory uh, Tells you how to change everything, and uh, it's supposed to be. Looks like it's high definition. Um, let me get my glasses on. Captured pictures with built-in memory. Uh, 1280 by 1024 and high, and 1024 by 768 and low. And it tells you how many pictures you can you can take. This also takes a 40 to 70 second uh, clip. Of course, there's no sound, but a video clip. And of course, you get your your little uh, install DVD. So let's check these out. I mean, there's there's not a scratch on them. They are absolutely flawless, except for that thing. That's the only it's the only bad thing about it. There's the camera now. Well, there's the camera. Now you know it doesn't show you what's on here, you know, but it will tell you how many pictures you have taken, and uh, it's supposed to have a battery indicator on it. So let's go ahead and put some batteries in here. I charged these up. I don't know if they're charged up enough or not. I haven't used these in a long time. I use these for my uh, my laser light and my paranormal equipment. Now it says hold this on or hold hold the menu the mode button until it comes on. There it is. Okay, so we have no pictures on it. All right. Now I don't know if. You know, you probably won't be able to, well, I guess you can see a little bit through that thing, but. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a couple still images and a couple video clips with this thing. It says the battery's full. Um, and then I will put those images and clips in right now.
Okay guys, as you can see it says, maybe you can see, it says full. So, the memory is full on here. It doesn't have um, a an SD card. So, I took, what, two pictures, one picture and two video clips. Uh, but, then you just hold this button and it shuts off. That's your mode button. Um, also, it has a timer on it, so that's pretty cool. What what it doesn't have, which surprises me, is a place for a tripod, which would really be nice. So these, like I said, I gave five bucks for. I don't know what they go for new, but I will look them up, put it on the screen here, so you know how much they are new, and I gave five bucks for it. So guys, that's pretty cool. Um, it'd be nice if it did take a memory card, which it doesn't. So I took uh, two video clips, like, well, you saw them 20 seconds long, 10 seconds long, kind of wiped out the memory. But um, I'll go ahead and I'll take these photos off. Well, let's see, it said, what, three on there? I'll go ahead and take these off and I'll, I'll add some more still images on at the end of this video and um, see what you guys think of it. Um, as far as keeping I don't know, Monkeys wanted a pair of uh, binoculars for a while. So I figured if anything, you know, Bushnell is a pretty good brand of binoculars and scopes for like rifles and guns and stuff. But, so... Um, seems to be pretty easy to use so it is user friendly I I mean I'm happy with five dollars on it and I thought hell even if the camera didn't work it'd be worth five bucks just to use as binoculars and yeah they they seem to do pretty good you got an adjustable eyepiece here on this on this side here and then you've got your focus here so yeah um, they're pretty comfortable I'm sure it'll be a little shaky because it's kind of like zooming in with a camera if you're not on a tripod and you're zoom, zoomed in pretty close to something uh, you know it gets shakier so that's my little flea market find for today And, you know, $5 worth. So, uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep them. I mean, I'm sure I could easily get $10 out of them. I don't see why not. Um, it seems to work pretty good. Um, let's see if it, um, you know, the, uh, the video clips AVI file. So, that shouldn't be an issue. As long as it imports onto the computer, we should be good. So, um, if you don't see any pictures after this clip, I'll do a little rant. But, <laughs> but, uh, um, but it seems to be working. I think it'll be fine. So, I'm going to go import these onto the computer, take some more images, and I'll put the images in right now after this clip. So stay tuned for that, and in the meantime, I'm going to say Shea Bear, the myth, the man, the legend. I'm gone for now. I keep looking at that screen. <laughs> I'm still not use this camera, but y'all be cool. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, and thanks for watching. Bye-bye, guys, and take care.